Welcome to my channel, Live in the Solution. I'm Mary Trimble and I'm here to give you a weekly reading. And um, this is a general reading. You may use it for your rising sun and moon signs. And you may want to check out my other videos. Because um, there is definitely some crossover in these uh, readings. So anyway, that link will be in the... Um, in the description box below and um, let's go back to shuffling the cards shall we <laughs> oh they are falling out like crazy you have a lot of messages here <laughs> oh dear okay that's okay oh and another one one more one more one more one more for Gemini, Gemini for next week, July 3rd through July 9th. Let's go, shall we? One more. Oh, there we go. Two, you've got two. Two more. Got an extra card there, um, Gemini. So, without further ado, let's go to the card, shall we? Gemini. Go to the first card. Oh, and we have the Empress. I love, love, love the Empress. She is one of my favorite cards. Okay, so this is telling us you've got the power to manifest, darling, right now in your life. This is really, look, she's pregnant. She's just fertile. You know, you can give, it's, for me, this means, you know, I mean, it could mean that you're pregnant, literally. I never take the literal meaning, though. Um, some of you may be, um, but this to me is a manifesting card. So this tells me that you have the power right now to manifest whatever you want. Really be careful about your thought processes. Remember the um, law of attraction because Gemini, this is a really great card. She's, she's just this creative being. She's giving birth to ideas. She's completely fertile. You've got this is like such a brilliant foundation to manifest your dreams. So don't shortchange yourself. Really look at your dreams because, and really uh, put things in place because you are uh, a manifesting goddess. Okay, so here we have the Five of Wands, which makes me think um, perhaps there's some bickering going on, maybe at work or maybe... Um, Maybe a lover or or somebody. There's bicker. This card means bickering, and when it comes up, it's asking you to be solution orientated and don't um, choose your battles wisely. Uh, don't pick up the sword um, necessarily, and don't cut someone with your you know uh, with your tongue. Um, I would say try to resolve this bickering by perhaps not even engaging in it, withdrawing from it. But this is almost like, it's almost like you can't help yourself, Gemini. It's this, um, it's this energy, underlying energy, and it's like a competition, and it's a backwards and forwards, um, you know unkindness almost okay so look this is interesting there's definitely don't forget to check out the other um the other readings because this this is the third time that this card has shown up in this place um so this is like uh you know really studying and you've really put the groundwork into something and that's what's wonderful about this this is like You've really been studious. You've really been focused. You're becoming um, an expert in what you're doing. Oh, and the strength. Well, this makes sense. Okay. So you've got the strength card, right? So you're really kind of bickering. But really, okay, so let me deal with this first. Look, the strength card. When the strength card comes up, it's saying that some people, look, you've got the symbol of unity right on top of her head. I mean, affinity. Um, strength sometimes is not in engaging in a fight. Sometimes strength is um, 
And that's exactly what I got with this. Strength is in compassion and kindness. And when the strength card comes up, it's saying that, you know, your strength can be in your compassion and kindness. And it's not a, a lot, you know, sometimes we think, oh no, people will think this is a weakness, but no, that's where your strength is, Gemini. Your strength is within your, don't lash out. Don't let that evil twin come out. <laughs> um, opposing forces, you know, don't, don't do that. Uh, be solution oriented and try to um, be diplomatic in uh, solving this uh, bickering problem um, because you are definitely underestimating your strength in this in your and your kindness and compassion look upon it as a di in a different um, look at it with a different perspective and let's see what these two have come out oh interesting Okay, so this, look, this is the Two of Cups, and this is almost like opposing force. Maybe it is in a relationship. Maybe that's what you are. Um, this is what's, okay, so you've got these two cards that fell together, and the Two of Cups is like, you know, it's, it's like the lover's card, right? It's two, um, you know, it's two people coming together, and it's usually quite good, but the Moon card came up with this so when the moon card comes up it's shining a light and the in the moon things can look differently right so this um, is this is this is saying um, things may not be what they appear to be um, so uh, let me tune into this card you know what? I want to clarify this card. I want to clarify these cards. I mean, for me, oh, look, okay, I don't need to. Look at the underlying energy is the justice card. Okay, so this is, look, this is doing things for the right reason, right? Making the right choice and doing things for the highest good of yourself. When I see this card, this could be a new love, right? Or a new, uh, pers you know, a new prospect, lovers. Um, but um, don't rush in blindly because it may not be what you think it is. It may not be the one. Um, now you've got, listen, you've got the strength. Everything that you have this underlying bickering going on and you've got to be solution oriented, orientated from that. I am, I'm really getting work here and um, not necessarily getting the the lover's card but I feel that you're going to meet someone and you're going to feel like he's your twin flame or she's your twin flame and um, uh, but this might not be the case and the, when the moon comes up it's just saying look you know shine the light on it don't rush in and just be careful and just proceed with caution and go a bit slow this is saying go a bit slow because this when the moon shows up things will be revealed so don't put don't put all your hopes in there things will definitely be revealed and you will be able to um you'll be able to see the bigger picture just give it time um but with all this going on this bickering and this competition you're you've got the underlying justice card which is saying look choose be diplomatic right be kind and compassionate make your choices for the right reasons um do the right thing for the right reasons the proper thing look it's the justice card you have to make the right judgment and it's got to be for the higher good of everyone not just you but for everyone um so you know Sometimes that means you've got to look at yourself and back off, you know, and, and how much you're engaging in this bickering. Um, of course, you know that this is for a general reading. Um, if you'd like a personal reading, you may email mary at liveinthesolution.com. Um, so this will, this is, um, this is what you have to do. You, you have to look for a diplomatic way to resolve these issues. So, uh, 
niggling but kind of can affect your whole life with that listen you've got the empress right she's creative she's magical she's a manifesting card you can manifest really wonderful things but with this you've got to sort this out first because that's going to take away from the power of this and you've got the strength right this is wonderful this is also saying this your strength is in com kindness and compassion don't forget that when you're sorting this out and doing things for the right reason and it looks like you're going to meet someone and it may not be um the one but you know what the moon card can work both ways so just take it slowly if you take your time once you get to know someone you're like oh wow okay this is not what i thought it was and so that's what this is saying so just you know you're going to meet someone exciting and new and you're going to be really into them but you know remember the moon card came up for you so just hold back a little bit you know just hold back a bit and wait wait for that light to really shine on it and wait for wait for it to run its course and see if this is good or not you know it can work both ways for you thank you for tuning in gemini thank you for liking sharing commenting and subscribing and um check out my other videos for your uh you know your rising sun and moon okay we'll see you next <laughs> i'll see you next week